Meanwhile, the campaign manager for the flag bearer of the NDC, Professor Joshua Alabi, has expressed confidence in the party's victory in the 2024 general elections. Professor Alabi, who served as the campaign manager for John Mahama in the 2020 polls, was reappointed by the Functional Executive Committee of the NDC on Wednesday to serve as the head of Mahama's campaign team. Here is more. The Functional Executive Committee of the National Democratic Congress, NDC, on Wednesday officially announced its national campaign team for the 2024 presidential and parliamentary elections. Key among the list is Professor Joshua Alabi, who has been reappointed as the head of the flag bearers campaign team. Now in 2020, Professor Alabi was appointed as the campaign manager for the flag bearer John Dramani Mahama. Professor Joshua Alabi highlighted some challenges that confronted the party in its campaign activities, which eventually led to its defeat in the polls. In the 2020 run-up to election, um, we had COVID in this country, uh, where we were all made to sleep for some time. We had to stay indoors. Mm, but um, they got already, they were working, and uh, for that matter, they could campaign and we were indoors. <laughs> and of course, like I'm sure you are aware, when we're sharing food and free uh, water and uh, free food and all that, we had a bad news, and that was the demise of our, um, our father, founding father of the party, that's uh, John J. Rollins. So we had to um, truncate our campaign we came again, we have to rest for about one week. Yeah, so we had a lot of, uh, what do you call it, breaks in our campaign, and we didn't start early. He also outlined some campaign strategies aimed at securing victory in the December polls. Every election has its own plan of work, and uh, this election is going to be a very critical one for us. And there's a belief out there that NDC has won the election already, and we don't want to believe in, we don't want to take that. Um, because, for example, if something belongs to you and don't protect it, then you come and take it. So we have to work. Yeah, so we're going to work. We're going to work. We are going to work in the various constituencies. We're going to go out there door to door, uh, like we did in 2008. We're going to add that to our campaign. And we're also going to look at our messaging and, um, and the plan of work. And... Um, uh, I'm very confident that with all this will work very hard. We will get a flabbera to the set of government. Professor Joshua Alabi says that the unfulfilled promises of the Akufuado government makes the flag bearer of the new patriotic party, Dr. Mahamud Baumia, less of a threat to the NDC's victory in the 2024 polls. If you have somebody who promised people um, one village, one dam, and you don't see it, uh, one constituency, one million dollar, you don't see it. One child, one chocolate, you don't see it. Um, one child, one uh, laptop, you don't see it. And these are practical things. And um, you move down to the regions and you promise them um, one village, one dam. And initially they started with seasonal boreholes and uh, uh, what, do, uh, what do you call it? Um, you don't even see anything moving on. Um, I think that um, the Ghanaians have had enough of uh, Dr. Bamia and he said, uh, economic theory, and um, we all know the performance of uh, his S.A. John Drama Mama when he was in office, the massive infrastructure development, and we know that um, now there's the, this thing to compare, and um, with this and with good messaging, uh, I'm very confident that we will get our flag bearer to the seat of government. Professor Joshua Alabi says that the party would not be complacent in its quest to emerge victorious in the 2024 general elections. Reporting for Channel 1 News, my name is Ni Ayukwe Okan.